Hello, I'm Matt Arndt. And I'm Bart Taylor. Welcome to our first time camper series. We know camping can be overwhelming in the beginning, so we have put together a series of videos to help first time campers like yourself. Today we're going to talk about developing a routine pre-travel checklist that will make your camping experience smoother and much more enjoyable. Start with a fully charged 12 volt battery and a full LP bottle. Now we'll move on with inspecting the tires, checking the pressures, and torquing the lug nuts. This should be done before every trip well in advance, so if you find a problem, you can get it fixed before your planned departure. While inspecting the tires, you're looking for uneven wear, flat spots, and damage. Check each tire's pressure and make sure it does not exceed the maximum pressure allowed. This can be found on the Federal ID sticker either on the front corner of the driver's sidewall or the sidewall of the tire itself. Torque the lug nuts to the appropriate foot-pounds in a star pattern. Remove all debris, sticks, pine cones, needles, snow, etc. from the main roof and the slide-out roofs. Closing the slide-out with debris on the roof will cause unwanted damage and expenses for repairs. Close all roof vents and windows, including the exterior range vent flap, if equipped. Place the television antenna in the down position, if applicable. Secure all loose items in interior storage compartments and cabinets. Inspect the interior of the RV. Ensure that all cabinet doors, interior doors, and shower doors are closed and secured. Televisions should be secured as well. Ensure the refrigerator door is closed and latched. Verify that all safety devices such as smoke, carbon monoxide and LP detectors and the fire extinguisher are in working condition. Close the valve on the LP bottle. Disconnect all part connections, cords, hoses, and securely store. In addition to your door locks, engage your deadbolt for transport as well. If equipped, position the battery disconnect to the off position. After reconnecting to the tow vehicle, stow the tire chocks and any leveling blocks. Inspect all exterior baggage doors and hatches ensuring they are locked. Check that the clearance lights, turn signals and brake lights are all working. Check your mirrors and it's time to hit the road. The information covered here can also be found in Chapter 4 of your Owner's Manual. As you develop your own checklist and do regular inspections, you will get to know your RV better and it will become easier to identify problems if or when they arise. Depending on the model and floor plan, you may have more or less of these features. Take time to write down your steps, adding the features you have on your RV. Taking time to do this now will save you time and stress later. Join us on the next video where we park, level, and stabilize.